This is yours. Assalamu alaikum. Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Jabi family. How are you guys doing, Jabi family? It's been a while we haven't tuned back, tuned with you guys. So welcome to another video. I'm with Daddy Jabi and Mommy Jabi today. We're here eating. You're gonna come and join us eat, eat with us. Because this is what we do now. Sorry about that. The memory card needed some space. It's a beautiful Sunday morning. Afternoon. Mm -hmm. We we invite all of you to to come to assist us to eat. Yes. Yeah, we we eating good food here. <laughs> um, African food. Mm -hmm. You know, it's very healthy, very nice. And the best thing about African food, we cook it home from scratch. It's the best. It's the best cooking. Okay. Alhamdulillah. And the, my, my wife, she know how to cook. Because it's not all, all women who know how to cook very good. <laughs> but my wife, she's trying his best, her, her, um, her best. You know. I invite you guys to come <laughs> test it. If you taste this, you're gonna like it. I know. Mm -hmm. And we're eating konkobore for those that doesn't know. It's a dry fish. It's delicious. With peanut butter. Mm -hmm. And how is the little jabbies doing in Morocco? We miss you guys so much. They always tell us they watch your videos. 
we miss you guys mommy and daddy miss you all isha and i will go to morocco and see you guys again My husband don't drink water when he's eating until he's finished. Me on the other hand, why you do that? Is that something you're taught when you're younger? That. They, they teach you that? Mm-hmm. Is it tradition mm. or what? Mm -mm. The place I grew up, mm -hmm. when we was eating, our fat, uh, grandfather, mm -hmm. they tell us, Eat, eat first because eating and drinking you're gonna be full mm -hmm. yes. very quick that's true yeah and he, he told us no don't drink if you finish eating then you're full and then you drink mm -hmm. i've noticed on him that he does that since we got married for over 11 years he never drink water so he finished eating and the food is finished and drink water no. But me because on the other hand. You have to separate your, your stomach in three different for the food, for the water and for the respiration. Yes. Yeah. The the life is like that. Mm -hmm. You separate for eating for the for the food, for the water and for respiration. Mm. Mm hmm And you can't keep thinking. You have to be completely full so you can't breathe. That's horrible to you. Mm-hmm. It feels so horrible when you like so stuff and you can't even breathe. Mm. So, Javi family, comment down below how you think if if you think that his way of eating is okay and it's it's interesting not to drink water till you finish because I cannot. I cannot. Okay, Javi family, we'll get back to you guys. Let us finish eating and then uh, we'll come back and we'll have a little thing that we have we're doing today. Ooh. Wow. Okay. It's pepper. Mm -hmm. So, later, stay tuned, don't go nowhere. Assalamu alaikum, Javi family. Assalamu alaikum. How are you guys doing? This is Mommy Javi. I'm home with my husband. Um, but he's taking a little nap so how are you guys doing welcome to my video for those that doesn't know my name is Mahawa I am a mommy youtuber and I have four lovely kids in Morocco study in Morocco and they are doing so well over there so and I've seen a few new subscribers a lot actually i'm so stunned and so happy for many people that has been subscribing thank you so much welcome to my family and now you're considered my family so this is also your family welcome to my family and thank you for supporting this channel and thank you for tuning in whenever you see a video and taking your time and watching it Thank you so much. Um, lately, things has been going a lot. It's been a lot going on. And I have been going through a few things, up and down, happy, sad, a lot. And for a few of my videos, if those that has not seen, my children, um, all is in Africa, yes. And they're doing so much better they're um try like they're doing education wise and health wise everything even the way they're talking acting they're so happy i just love it i just love it but i wish i could come see them again that's the most thing because for those that doesn't know me all my whole life has been around my children so when they're now away i kind of miss them because that's what I know as life, is being around my children. But um, I've closed my eyes and my husband and I decided that we want to guide them through the path of Deen, Islam. So when we decided to send them to Morocco so that they could be able to learn Islam and 
the benefits of Islam and the teaching and the, and the true understanding of Islam. I just, we just one day just decided, let's do it. And we prayed and prayed, prayed to God. And one day we just saved up. And then before you know, we sent, we went with them to Morocco. Few of our video, videos that I reposted, probably one of you guys can see. We went to Morocco for a month and we experienced. Oh, sorry about that, guys. I'll get back to you. Assalamu alaikum, Gabby family. How are you guys doing, my lovelies? Uh, how wonderful today feels. How are you guys doing? Um, today is such a blessful day, alhamdulillah, that Allah, the Almighty, let us see the day bright. And to be able to witness this wonderful day. How are you guys doing? How's your Thanksgiving? Mine went so well. And I miss my little Yavi so much. My children. I miss you guys. So, um, right now, I have a last minute run up to do. Because I'm going to get something from a Target. Because my husband has a little surprise for me like a little getaway from from um, New York for a while and I just can't wait I'm so happy and I'm so ready to be in different environment because I feel like it's been a while before since I haven't traveled so when I hear travel I get so excited right now and since last month was our wedding anniversary in October we couldn't celebrate anything because um I was also sick, but alhamdulillah, I'm doing so good. And not that sickness is bad. Sickness is also a try, a trial to see your iman and how strong you are as a believer. So when you come across with anything like that, it just makes you remind you of you're not in control of your body. Allah, there's something beyond you that controls everything in this universe so i'm pretty glad that i was able to go through that phase and slowly recovering from the sickness and alhamdulillah and i pray to allah to continue giving me strength and giving me more patience and putting making my iman more strong because it's not easy alhamdulillah though i'm feeling much better and that's why I believe I've been so lost in this channel. I've been lost, but inshallah, we're going to go back. Um, we also have... Um, we also have a little getaway that we're, we planned and my husband just told uh came up with this plan i'm so glad he did because it's very much needed right now because <laughs> new york is not easy it's very much needed so we have this wonderful plan getaway that we're planning and i just can't wait i just can't wait for this so jabby family stay tuned if it's not on this vlog next vlog is shanda you're going to be able to see us getting ready, um, traveling to a beautiful, beautiful state. And I'm not going to tell you guys the name. You guys could guess down below where we are going. And lastly, come along with me to um, get some last minute um, shopping for my little trip. I'm, I'm just going to go to Target and go to a few stores that's around my neighborhood so that I could um, get something for... Um, like some things that I might need for the, while I'm going, while I'm at the trip over there. And it's going to be extremely fun. I can't wait. I feel so, oh, I feel so rejuvenated and happy for it to, to go another place. Oh my God, I need it. It's been months I haven't traveled. So stay tuned, Yabby family. And for those that has not subscribed, subscribe to the channel. Welcome. And for those that has been here. Welcome to this vlog. Stay tuned and see the little stuff that I get for my last minute run up. <laughs> Salam alaikum. See ya.
just got back from my little trip <laughs> my long trip I'm so tired I feel so tired I thought I was not gonna take this long I was wish hoping that I go in real quick and come back out because I was assuming people don't have money in a People don't have money in America right now, so they're not spending money in clothing or like they're not being in the store for too long. But I guess I was wrong. It was packed today, which is very surprising. I thought it was not going to be packed at all. It was packed and the lines were long. Oh, thank God I made it home safe. Alhamdulillah. So right now I'm just going to cook something real quick for my husband before he gets... He's up already, but I'm going to try to get him something to eat because I left while he was sleeping. So, as a wife, your job never finished. So, that's what I'm going to do right now. And later on, I will show you guys the little cute stuff that I got from Target and um, what's the other store? I went to two stores. So, you get to see all the goodies that I got. like a little toy for baby Mohammed I'm telling you every mom is guilty of this when you go to stores you don't think about yourself first you think about your children so when I got in there I was on a video call with them and I remember they was telling me oh this is the kind of toys we use so I was like oh my babies don't have toys like the way they used to have here so I was like I'm gonna get them more toys <laughs> so I got baby Mohammed this one he loves cars because I've noticed he was riding a car with his big brothers in the house so I was like I guess he's into car now before he wasn't he was into dra uh, like dinosaurs animals are scary but then <laughs> he went back to Morocco he got into things that the oldest brothers like and I got Ibrahim some of the Hot Wheel cars that he loved. And this is like his little collections of cars that I always get him. So this is the only kind that I always get him is Hot Wheels. And lastly, if I tell you I went there and got my baby's stuff and I forgot about myself. <laughs> you would tell me if you see me in the store that I had a plan to go shop for my children not for myself but I couldn't help it I went there I forgot about myself and I got some toy it was mostly toys for the kids because I felt like they needed some more toys back home so my <laughs> I'm kind of guilty, guilty a little so I got my daughter these little toys because I used to love little dolls, like short dolls when I was young. I remember that. So I, I want her to try and see if she would like the little dolls. It is so cute. Like they're all different colors, different skin tone, which I love. So I got I was able to get her some stuff because nowadays it's hard to find dolls that is all dark. So I was like, you know what? I'm going to get different shades of skin tones. As you guys can see, some of them are dark, light skin, brown skin, all different colors. It's extremely cute. And lastly, um, for my little trip, if I tell you how hard it was to even decide if I should buy this or not for myself, it's crazy. It's awful. I need to change the habit. I'm trying. I'm trying. But it's very hard when you 
all your life has been about babies, babies, children's children. So like for you to put yourself back in the, the center again is a very hard thing. And Isha, and I'm praying that it gets, fa I recovered from it faster than I am doing because it's almost going to be a year since they've gone. And I'm so, I feel like it's so slow on me and I'm not liking it. <laughs> but luckily, when I was going around, I found the little uh, boots that I tried on and it looked it so cute. So this is going to be for my little outfit that I will be wearing when I'm going to the airport with my husband. And since it's going to be a trip of walking, I decided to get myself a little um, a heel. It's called heel support so that I don't get tired while I walk a lot. Because I know how turkey is. I told you guys the destination of where I'm going. <laughs> but let's pretend nobody heard it. I know the place I might be going is going to be, we're going to be doing a lot of walking. So I'm afraid and my husband loves to walk. So it's going to be fun. It's going to be very interesting. And this one will help with the, my, my heels to support my back because now I'm, I'm extremely feeling the back pain. After child labors, the pain comes to you and it's just getting... Like when I do certain things or wear certain shoes, my back feels it so bad. So I need to try different methods of how to cure this back pain. And lastly, I got myself um, socks and for around the house too, because I felt like I need to start loving Mahawa process again, taking care of her again, and loving this body again. <laughs> And just be me again. So I was like, you know, let me get myself a cute sock so my feet could be silky smooth like a baby bottom. And a neck massager for tra uh, I mean, a travel pillow. It's a travel pillow. I had this when we were traveling for a long distance, like international one, when we were leaving here to go to Morocco and. I felt so much better when I traveled with these and put these on my neck, my back, and it just felt much better. And I was able to sleep longer and and enjoy the flight. Cause I'm telling you, when you fly in 12 hours, 15 hours, you might need the you need to be feeling as comfortable as you need to be, like the way you feel in your home. I don't know. Me, I, for that long of a sitting down or sleeping I need to feel comfortable so I got myself this and I think I got one already for when I was returning back from Morocco to here and I might just give this to my husband because it's dark for men color and let I'll look around the house for it if I find it anyway so those are the stuff that I got and that's about it I thought I was gonna get more stuff for myself but I couldn't I tried so the vlog is not finished yet it's just getting started my husband is here and he's still in the shower <laughs> he's still in the shower and right now i'm just make uh cooking some rice and we're gonna have we're gonna have a uh, little we're gonna eat i'm gonna have little rice we're gonna eat together and enjoy our little companies together so and also after we finish we will be um still preparing our stuff putting our stuff together that we'll be taking with us to to our little trip i can't wait trips is travels is wonderful Assalamu alaikum. come say hi to my family come say hi to the daddies come say hi to your family Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh, Yavi family. How are you guys? I hope you are you are doing good. Yes, okay. I hope so too. Okay. Just to say hello to you guys, okay? Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. He just got out the shower. Men is lucky, they get to do everything in a relaxing way. Hey, Ati, look what I got us. 
ji model de mu fa yi model de la ma ah ke gina da na naki ya ma nayi ta mbara ne ana 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 san da ku yi ana mini na sak na sak na do sa de mun sa de ana meni ma i be ri fine sike sa ma to ana na anyway e ta mu ne ta yi ka me yi sa ri kire yes ke sa ma to so na ta no ma ji utilize de inta na bo re utilize yes ke sa ma to i am so smart i'm so smart just exactly as i said i thought I was like, I knew he might not have it, so I'm gonna give him this one, and I'm gonna use the one for the girl, ladies. Get a big one, mom. Oh, why is it hard for me? Yeah, in the bag, there's a there's a big one. Yeah, yeah. Instead of saying something, instead of saying I'm gonna do it and give it. And for those that does not know, my husband. It's a Manjungo tribe, Jahanka tribe, and I am Susu. My father is Susu tribe, where and we speak in our home. We speak most of the time Susu, because he's also mixed with Susu. He's Jahanka and Susu. Give him money. Look, I like it. This is gonna be how many? How many hours flight is gonna be? Six hours from here to to French. And don't tell us the destination. They they, they have to guess. <laughs> mm -hmm. Don't tell them the destination. So yeah, be family. You guys have to guess the destination. And from France to over there is three hours. So all together. Some people are gonna know. They they're gonna. They're gonna. They will know. You think they will know where we're going? Yeah, if you if you told them like uh, from. From here to France is six hours, and from over there, from France to over there, is three hours. Maybe they're gonna, some people are gonna know. <laughs> yep. So that's the riddle. Solve it. Whoever knows how long it's gonna take, and who knows us the most. <laughs> huh? So you shaved your hair? Yeah. The silk is slick. Tara neki. You know, I like to shave my hair. I don't like my hair grow. I don't like that. Yes, I. Yeah. Since I know this man, he doesn't have. He have long hair, but he doesn't like it long, which is not bad. Life is however he wants it. I'm okay with it. So I guess this is. It's kind of manly. I think I'm gonna give this to my husband because he said he there's the uh, pink one. For ladies, so you, you, don't, you don't see you don't see men men picture here. <laughs> you don't see men picture here. This for men. No, I don't think so. I, I see men picture here. I think it's for it's unisex, but yeah, but I see the men picture here. If it was woman, they look. Maybe unisex. I don't know. I don't. I see the men picture here. Oh man, what a what what a day. Anufa, I was selling the Javi family. I thought people don't have money. <laughs> My people got money to spend. The store could have been all over. Black Friday. I don't know. It was just pack. Black Friday said. Oh. I'm so tired, Javi family. My back is hurting me. I'm gonna rest a little. And I'm going to let my husband pray, so I'll talk to you guys in a few minutes.